Hello and welcome everybody to the second part of WPML Multilingual Languages for WordPress. Let's get started with mini translation into Arabic and English using WPML. Let's begin. First thing you go appearance menus and by by going to this menu you're gonna see we don't have any menu yet so we need to add a new one. So go refresh the page you gotta see we got the default menu here by WordPress but we don't have any WordPress uh, custom menu so let let me add a new one let me just create test menu and it's gonna be test english alright and the language is english create this menu so we get the first menu so we can add custom links or custom pages or anything you want so let me add for example home and add it to the menu let me add about us and add it also to the menu and save this menu here and save this the same thing we save the menu we got two items in this menu uh, but we didn't assign a location to this menu okay location let me make it finally first thing we got the English version of the menu we need to make the Arabic version in order to do that you have this option here Transl translation Arabic plus so you can add a translation from here add a plus sign we created languages Arabic translation of test English you need to type the menu name so I'm just gonna name it test AR create menu so we created a relative menu related menu to the English menu so we got the same version but in this version we don't have any item so you need to add all the items from the English version to Arabic version but you change the language manually so in order to do that we created home which is mean I see an Arabic okay and we created um, the other one let me save it we created English we created about us so we need the same thing how how mocha add to menu so we got two version which translation our translation for the same language English Arabic so you're gonna select the location for the theme so primary menu you just select the primary location for the Arabic version test AR and for the English version we're gonna cho choose the primary menu for the English version so you can save all these changes let me just go to the main website by going here you're gonna see home about us you're gonna go change to Arabic. You're gonna see Arabic about the website. This is for um, the first thing for creating custom menu in Arabic and English. We we gonna add the same menu but using custom menu. Let me go to the footer here and add a custom menu to the footer. In order to do that, you have to register a menu and after that take this menu and display it in your place. So you can do that by going to um, the theme that we are working on which is um, WAMP server WW multilingual website okay we gotta go content themes we get 2011 we go to footer so we need this uh, we need this footer in order to add uh, you know we in order to add uh, the menu here and also we need the function is the PHP in order to to register our custom menu. So just find functions that PHP. We got this functions that PHP. We can now register menu. So in order to register a menu, we got 2011 setup here. We got register navigation menu, and this is gonna call. Um, you know, you're just gonna register a new menu. So I need to register a custom a custom menu and that can be done using uh, this script if you go sample here we got we're gonna register a new menu in the functions the PHP so if you go to 2011 setup or if you go to uh, for example to any place on your screen here so 2012 I'm sorry we will work and we should work with 2012 functions of PHP alright so we are in 2012 so we can add uh, 
the following script in order to register the menu but I'm just gonna name it bottom and this is gonna be bottom because it's gonna be in the bottom and this is the first step you need after you register your menu and add the action to the in, in it you need to uh, call this menu so I'm just gonna call this menu using this script and I just wanna locate this script in the folder in the 2011 uh, folder so I just go footer so I'm just want to put it uh, some somewhere here so let me put it here all right so we got a call uh, bottom menu from the function the PHP and this is just a class name and this is the identifier for the menu you can change it to anything you want in order to change with a CSS and play with a style so this is how we we just put everything inside uh, an, uh, an object and after that we just get the content from the object that get clean and after what we do, just echo the menu out so this is how we uh, call the menu right now if you go to um, your WordPress you go to appearance you go to uh, we gotta go to themes and menus you're gonna see we got a new place called bottom and this bottom if you go to the visit site it's gonna be located here in the footer so, alright but since we didn't put any menu we get we just gonna get home and sample page in order to override that you just need to select your menu I'm just gonna select the same menu that we define just English and here for Arabic and the same thing for Arabic you're gonna say it's automatically smart and know it because it's binded to the same menu so we gotta see test AR here so just gonna save all the changes refresh the page go to the bottom we're gonna see home about us if you go to the tab and navigate to Arabic you're gonna see how so it's the, this is how we work with a uh, custom menu using uh, WBML so thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe to channel stereo 7 and see you in other video thank you for watching